Hey guys, Zerk. This is Glenda. We are d and Miniature and Board Games. So, today we're going to bring you Risk Battlefield Rogue. 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 So, as an ongoing of uh, some of the Risk games that we've purchased over the years that we actually haven't even opened up and played. Collection of Risk games. I like Risk. I don't know, can a I lot. Say that? Yeah. Like, a lot. So, for those of you who don't know what's in this, we're going to go ahead, we're going to open it, and we're going to look inside oh, of it. Oh, you love that, huh? Yeah, well, you know. <laughs> so, first thing up, the gray guys. The gray guys. They're teeny tiny guys. And then the we got a bag guys. of black guys. So there is, it looks like, four different yes uh huh four different colors but there's also looks like four different designs in each one what would you they call kinda, those blue they kind of stick to a kind of more early color well yeah makes sense and yellow yellow i don't know if you call that yellow <laughs> yeah it is yellow but that kind of yellow and odd there must be ah oh, yep see there's stickers there do it your own. Yeah, so. So the dice come without the stickers on them. And then you have a the sticker. Mm -hmm, that you're going to have to put. That you put on each one. And it actually tells you apply to black dye, white <laughs> dye. I guess it adds to that fun of making your own dye. <laughs> and then we have a, a few of these little... Uh, white tokens here. Yep. White tokens. White tokens. White tokens. So, apparently we have three, three. rule books. Are they all rule books? Are you sure? They look like really a replica. Well, let's see. Let's see. Game guide. Game game components and game, game components. game components. I guess we have three, three. rule books for the game, so which I comes in really handy because everybody gets correct. one basically. That's what it is. Well, if that was really the case, so we'd have four. But we have three. We have three. So one can share. I mean, the other two can share. All right. So your the the white bases are the commander bases. So you put these underneath the uh, commander figure. And then just like in, for those of you who aren't familiar with Battlefield, you have Assault, Engineer, Recon, and Support for Battlefield. Just let me tell you something. That's Eric's favorite. Um, I play Battlefield a lot. A lot. A lot. Like a lot. Well, I used to. I mean, I Video game. can't remember the last time I picked up a joystick. <laughs> All right. So it's your basic uh, risk rule book. I like how. Don't pass it, cause we we, we have our own <laughs> rule book. Sometimes that comes in handy to have your own rule book. And you can argue about it too. So <clears throat> now, unlike a normal risk game that has a game board, correct? You have the map map tiles, mm -hmm. and anybody that's familiar with Battlefield will understand airfield. Uh, Probably weapon supply. Ooh. They're still stuck together. Yep. And they are two sided. So why don't we I was gonna show say. both sides of those? Yeah. Ooh, another zipper. Another little bag. Note, the scenario shown on the Carnage card should include tile 5B, not 3B. There is a uh, quick note. Quick note. Commander token. So, it said something about scenario shown, right? You didn't say how many? Did you see scenarios? How many? Um, yeah. Well, let's see the difference. I mean, now I'm looking because uh, I wonder if we got three rule books. 
So, 80 combat, 12 commander bases, 6 double-sided battlefield tiles, 10 dice, 99 leadership weapons and air support cards, 9 scenario cards. So, yeah, is the there... Three. Are there scenario cards in amongst these? Uh-huh. So, I guess you just have to. No, there's nine scenario cards, 17 cover tokens, 12 anti tank, 12 starting zones, 8 commander tokens, label sheet, storage bag, and game guide. So, I'm thinking that we might be missing the nine <laughs> scenario cards. We may also be missing the. Yes, I'm, I, I think there might be something missing in our game. Uh-huh. I'm uh, I'm not ruling it out right now. I'm thinking there there's there's the uh, I'm I guess severely that's what thinking that boxing uh, is for, right? You see if you get everything you buy, you know, what should be in the box, but it looks like we're missing it. The scenario games. Well, it's a good thing we aren't trying to play this today. <laughs> that would be difficult. <laughs> or you can just print it. Well, it looks like I'll be contacting uh, Hasbro, and uh, so did we get all the uh, things? Six double-sided. Okay. Are there six? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Yeah. So it looks like uh, that. What leadership, is that? air support, and weapons. I think. Well, you know what? I'm not gonna think. Yeah. Okay. But well, we're just unboxing today and see what's inside and. What's not, and... So obviously you're already uh, seeing that, that we are missing stuff. Okay. Because, uh, yeah. Yeah, because these are just duplicates anyway. So yeah. there's nothing, I don't see anything different in this, so... Aha! Uh -huh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. So... Leadership cards. So it looks like we're missing leadership Those. cards, too. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. That's what I'm saying. Hasbro Gaming! You guys messed up. Be expecting my email sometime soon. We will. Because we want to play this. That's right. Hey, as always, guys, support your local gaming. We support Discover Games in Fayetteville, Georgia. Game on, guys. Game on.